Hey everyone, Katie here. Hello world. Um, and I want to talk about an art project that I started back in around 2014 called Tiny Huge Impact. And it is a 3D model of basically a uh, Mario, Super Mario level of my own design. And um, I want to do a walkthrough of it for people and an artist statement, obviously. So, since it's now at least six years old and you can see the dust that has formed yet again on it, um, let's get into it. So, first of all, the name, Tiny Huge Impact. Uh, three major meanings tied with that. One is a play on what it's based uh, off of a Super Mario 64 level called Tiny Huge Island and the drawing you can see here that I did out of uh, oil pastel that is from the picture you jump into in Mario 64 to get into that level so that's a reproduction of that and um, I believe you know that started way back in uh, Super Mario Brothers 3 to like the tiny huge island or world technically but mine was based on the 64 one because that was the first one I played. Um, also because it is well one thing you know like this huge world and idea and I just made it all of the voice lines on the house itself the obviously paper Um, so, you know, for Tiny Huge Impact, it's a huge world. And, um, so Tiny Huge Impact, we're doing that. What else? Um, just that, you know, it's a small thing in life, just playing video games and stuff, but it had a huge impact on me. You know, when I was like three or four years old, you know, me, my dad, and my sister, we'd be playing uh, Super Mario World because, you know, we got the Super Nintendo and we were all playing it together. So it's, you know, family time. Me and Barb would always um, play it growing up into our teens and stuff. So it was a bonding experience, too, and, you know, time we shared together and enjoy. And it was just, you know, a, a happy time in my life versus, like, any unhappy moments, which, you know, there have been several. <laughs> But, um, so obviously it's had a huge impact when I'm, like, still in my 30s and I'm absolutely in love, you know, with Mario and Nintendo stuff. Uh, and also the idea of Tiny Huge Impact. I think I said three. I might have gotten four in there now. But, um, yeah, the fourth idea is, yeah, it can have a big impact on your wallet. Um, I use coins in here, as you can see, mostly pennies, so I wouldn't waste it, but obviously some nickels maybe a few dimes here and there too but um you know video games take a lot out of your pocket they they cost a lot fast especially Nintendo games um so you know something you love and cherish so much but at the same time you know it's it's a habit that's expensive to continue so that's a bit of a critique on that also you know it's fitting because Mario collects coins and stuff so I mean that's kind of an homage to um, but I mean, also they were just smaller items around that fit with the scale of the, um, the model and everything. So that's the concept with that. And then I want to get into what this mixed media is actually made of.